Hello friends, welcome to Amazon Webcast. In today's video demonstration, we are going to see how to configure message delivery restriction for a user mailbox. By default, user mailboxes are configured to accept messages from anyone. To override this behavior, you can specify that the only messages from the listed users, contacts or groups can be accepted. Or you can specify that the messages from specific users, contacts or group can be rejected. You can also specify that the only messages from authenticated users, meaning a user who have logged on to the action system or the domain can be accepted. Now let's see, for our user name administrator, we want to enable the message delivery restriction. So select the user mailbox and click on detail. This will open the user mailbox property. On a property box, select mailbox feature. Just scroll little bit and the find options message delivery restriction. Click on view detail. This will open up the another console where you can specify the message delivery restriction options. Here we have a first options name accept messages from and under that all senders options is by default selected. This option specifies that the user can accept messages from all senders. This includes both senders in your exchange organization and the external senders. This is the default options. It includes external users only if you clear the require that all senders are authenticated. If you select this checkbox, messages from external users will be rejected automatically. You can also select only senders in the following list and just click on plus sign. It will display you all the user mailbox from your exchange organization. Click on add and click on OK. That means only the user listed over here, they are able to send message to a user named administrator. And we do not want to select that. Just again, let's select all sender. Now here we have options for reject messages from. Use these sections to block people from sending messages to these users and the by default option selected is no sender. This option specifies that the mailbox won't reject messages from any sender in the exchange organization and this is the default options. Here you can select senders in the following list. Let's select this, click on plus sign and let's add a user name test. Click on add and click on ok. That means the user name test is not able to send a mail to a user administrator. Click on ok, click on save. And that's it. Now the user administrator is not able to receive any mail from the user taste. Let's open the user mailbox of our user taste and let's try to send a mail from this user to our administrator. Taste email for message delivery restriction. This is a sample email. Click on send and that's it. After waiting a few seconds, you will receive a mail, mail from Microsoft Outlook. Taste email for message delivery restriction. Delivery has failed to these recipients or groups. Your message couldn't be delivered to the mailbox because you do not have a permission to send it. Ask the mailbox email admin to grant you the permission and then try again. So when you do not have a permission to send a mail to a particular user and if you send the mail that time you will receive a non-delivery report from action system. So this is the way how you can set up email delivery restriction for a particular mailbox in your exchange 2016. That's it for this video demonstration. Thanks for watching this video.